Well, we are in our fourth week of Latinx Heritage Month, and with each new week, we will continue to highlight a Latinx leader here in our Kern County area. This week, we have two Latinx ladies who make any celebration much sweeter. 23 ABC's Rosara Simone joining us in studio to give us a closer look at the Dulce sisters' journey to sweet success. The Dulce sisters started their business in the wake of COVID after losing their jobs. Unsure of what the future held, they took a treat they enjoyed and turned it into a business where they take hundreds of orders. Their candy business uses Mexican spices like chamoy, salt, paprika, cumin, and so much more to make a Latin spin on candy classics like Gushers and white peach rings. With Halloween around the corner, the girls are introducing even more treats and creating yummy platters. But the Dulce sisters want young Latinx girls to know they weren't always this successful. I feel so accomplished. Like I never thought I'd get to this point because before like before we even started our business, I didn't know what I wanted to do. In addition to running a business, both sisters are in ultrasound tech school and work day in and day out to balance schoolwork and their business. Both girls say they know how hard it can be to be Latina, but it's important to keep pushing forward. I want little girls to know that whatever they do, just keep pushing, keep going. Like, don't be afraid. Don't let anybody stop you. Like, you are empowered. You are a woman. We can do anything. If you'd like to order from the Dulce sisters, head to our website at turn223.com for a link. Keely, well, you could celebrate Latinx Heritage with me because I got my candy here. And I'm willing to share with you, girl. I am. I always say sharing is caring, so <laughs> that looks Ooh. too good. Uh, let's just have some right now. We you want to do the news. Yeah. I'll bring it to you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, still ahead, hug it out.